sister ships with same speed, load, hull, and ambient conditions but significant different daily fuel oil consumption. The red ship sister ship with the blue one has 12.3% more oil fuel consumption than blue one with the same drafts, hull engine, propeller, and voyage condition. First step of investigation is power and thrust measurements used strain gauges system either for new buildings and old ones. Red ship requires more power and more thrust than the blue one at the same vessel speed with the values presented in the same color as for the ship referred. Hull geometry distortion are the cause of increased ship resistance. Result of ship design is a perfect smooth and symmetry body. During construction the tolerance of block build strongly depends of the shipyard experience and the building field conditions. Design and as build body lines, red ones, differences are presented. Owners to avoid happens the same hull deformation to the next sister ship focus on block building procedure. Block supporting by subcontractor on the ground at 2-3 DEG, green, and at the top of 4-2 DEG, blue, due to the ambient temperature and sun radiation at open field, creates distortion for 56 mm at the top. The block deviation from design magnify extremely when the blocks join together. The ship without zoom and with zoom 100 times. Hull deformation due to the grounding can scanning accurately by laser with red color the bending areas and by blue the twist ones. Scanning distortion of main deck by laser. For number of causes during dry docking the deformation has increased rapidly due to improper hull support. Dry dock blocks has to rearrange taken into account the hull deformation. Up to day laser scanning and mapping ship hull technology easy determine hull distortion. At China. At Portugal. At Turkey. Hull resistance calculated with as built geometry is bigger than the one with design geometry. Measurements of fuel oil consumption during sea trials at a number of vessel speeds and compared with sister ships ones is an effective test to check hull condition.